This is Juan Mendoza reporting for Rebel News. So with the recent iCloud leak that looks at Hunter Biden and all the actions he's been doing there with his family. So on Sunday, a programmer who worked with Maxi posted a live stream video outlining his intention of dropping Biden's Hunter Biden's entire hard drive online, along with clues for users to break into the iPhone and iPad backups. He put it on 4chan, which is some sort of website that basically not very moderated and it's kind of the website of last resort for people who want to get information out there but can't because everything is so completely censored at this point. So even on 4chan, the moderators quickly took these links down, but internet users are already seeding the contents of the backups on torrent sites. Bottom line, this is going to live online forever. It's not going away. We're here in Miami to talk with the people to see what their thoughts are about the Biden family. So there's like an iCloud leak uh, that came out recently through uh, 4chan and like another laptop leak that came out a few years ago, uh, seeing how uh, Hunter Biden was doing uh, lots of like uh, illegal activity, like cr uh, looking at him. He was like measuring uh, crack cocaine and like he was engaging in sex with prostitutes and like he has his uh, dad put on his phone as pedo Peter. So uh, what are your thoughts about the Biden family? Um, well, that doesn't <laughs> seem good. Like, that's not, um, yeah, that's not okay. That is something that shouldn't be happening. People need their like, um, what's it called? Like, their stuff hidden. Like, they need their privacy. And that's not okay to be leaking that information. I think they suck. <laughs> I'm sorry, I Biden doesn't know what he's talking about, and his son is a crook. <laughs> I've heard uh, about controversy with Hunter Biden, but not much about that. I don't know. I can't give out any details. Okay. I've never heard that much about him at all, so no, no details about it. Uh, I think they're pretty weird. I mean, I kind of had a little bit of more respect for Biden after what he did with Roe v. Wade. But like now it's just after hearing that it's just weird, man. Um, I honestly don't get into politics a lot. I do not care. I mean, you can't really change it even if you want to. So I just try to stay out of it. <laughs> wow, I did not know that. That's crazy. I mean, I'm not really much into politics, but that's, that's insane. That's really, that's out of pocket. <laughs> I, I don't know what to say to that, honestly. I saw, I looked through the leaks because it's public now. There's some very concerning things like child pornography on it, on Hunter Biden's leaks, which, I mean, it should be looked into, but thoroughly I believe that the most of the pe reasons people are looking into the family is because, you know, the president, and it's more political, but in this case, I feel people should be looking into it because there's like very concerning things along with what they found. The Biden family, I feel like um, they're lacking a lot of, um, connectivity like between themselves and they're lacking a lot of respect and education as a whole um, I just I don't really um, believe in like their family I feel like it's just a, a fake picture that they put out there personally I'm not a huge fan of Biden however he did just release like a press talk about not supporting the whole turnover of Road versus Wave that kind of made me support him a little bit but personally like Biden's not my favorite person so not a big fan. Do you think he's like, like personally, like his family's more like, uh, like not really uh, good people, but you support more like his politics rather than like his? I don't really support his politics a lot, but I think he has some good ideas if he can actually act on them, but that hasn't really been shown. Personally wise, like how his family is, I don't know much about him, but I do not really like him in office. Yeah, but that's my opinion. Um, I think that this whole thing is shady and someone needs to like, you know, get in, get into what they're going um, and like figure out what's happening. I mean, that's pretty much it. Yo, honestamente, yo no me meto ni me entierro en el político porque yo no prefiero a ningún lado que lo otro. Yo creo que Biden es igual el pendejo que es Trump, igual a cualquier otra persona. Yo creo que si no es nada fijo, si no es ninguna evidencia que puede ser firmemente comprobado, yo no voy a usar eso para decir ay que Biden esto y esto y esto la cosa es también es que eso fue encontrado en 4chan 4chan es reconocido para un lugar donde extremistas ponen su cosa y después hablan cosas que no es, no es comparable ni es, ni es verdad pero al mismo web yo no estoy diciendo que no es posible a mí el hijo de él tenía problemas de droga no pero yo yo no tengo ningún como opinión como <laughs> Is that real? 
Apparently so. Okay. I'm like trying to pro like what? I don't necessarily have a huge thought on them. Um, I know there's a lot of hate towards them just from the opposing point of view, but personally I I know he's our president and that's basically it. <laughs> that's all I know. Yeah, I don't follow them, but I have heard some things, but I'll never know if they're true. I just you know. I think the most I know is um that like in the he was a uh, came back from the war and he was like not in a an honorable or not honorable whatever something like that. I don't remember. But that's all I know <laughs> about them. I mean, no sabía que esto estaba pasando, pero yo no creo que eso está correcto. Eso no suena bien. Pero sí. yo nunca he oído esto hasta ahora. No sabía. I don't feel like his family defines him as a person and his decisions that like what he, you know, like the way he controls this country, I don't think it has to do with his son or whatever. Like each person is each is their own, you know what I mean? But I also like I don't agree 100% with Biden. I think there's a lot of things that are wrong with the way he's leading this country, you know. I feel like he's a puppet. I feel like he's not making the decisions on his own like, you know, someone is He's not he does not like the best leader, you know. I don't see him like a very you know, like a good leader. So even though I'm like, you know, I'm, I would yeah, I'm democratic, you know. I want someone I'm more I'm like a leftist, but I don't really like how Biden has been running everything, so. But I I don't care whatsoever like all this gossip about his family and whatever. I don't think that defines who he is or that has to do with anything. Like it's to me I feel like it's unnecessary. And, no, not really. I can't say I've really kept up too much with that. Uh, I'm not too aware of the situation, so I can't really speak on it that much, but that sounds pretty crazy. That's, that's pretty crazy, yeah. I don't, I don't know anything about that. Yeah. Same, <laughs> same, same, same reaction. Yeah, same, yeah, same yeah. reaction. That's just like insane. Yeah, we didn't know about that. It sounds like my type of guy. Do you feel like the Biden administration, they're like representing the people in the country uh, pretty well? or? Um, can I put no comment? Um, no thoughts. No opinions, no. Nothing. Some, maybe. Definitely not all. Me, personally, eh, there's good and bad. I wouldn't say I'm a supporter, but there's a few things they've done that I liked. Some people didn't like Biden, even if they were Democrats, and others had no clue. Who would like to help us fund these reports and help us expand our coverage of Miami and the Florida sector, you can do so by going to rebelnews.com.